and we are live. Bam! What's going on, everybody? It's a late, a late night one tonight. Welcome back to Cuts from the Couch. Tonight, we are actually going to do or attempt to do a full haircut. We haven't done that since the first time um, we attempted this way back with Eric. Um, but we're going to uh, we're gonna have fun with it tonight. Um, a good friend of Idle Hand, uh, super talented singer songwriter, Lynn from uh, the band Paris. Um, she's gonna come on and she is going to cut her roommate Sean. Don't worry, they're both in quarantine. They live together. Um, and she's going to attempt to give him a haircut. We're going to show you some tricks. Or I'll show you some tricks. I'm going to show her some tricks. Um, also, I'd like to thank Wall for getting Wall got Lynn out a pair of clippers um, within the last couple of days, which was incredible because Wall, Wall has, for, for my knowledge, Wall has pretty much stopped all... Um, all manufacturing of clippers, at least in the United States, uh, to help with the face masks and everything else that is going on in the crazy world right now. So they aren't even making clippers as of right now, at least to my knowledge. So for them to be able to pull this off, which which was uh, pretty awesome of them. So thank you again, Wall. Um, but yeah, let me see. Uh, let me see where. Where Lynn is at. Boom, boom, boom. Okay. Oh. Oh, wait. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> We've gone, we've gone black. <laughs> I have one of the weird uh, little thingies on my iPad. Is it too bright? Right? Is it too bright? No. Let's do it over the side. All right. We're going to move a little. There we go. Well, I'm in the dock here. Welcome <laughs> to a humble abode. There we go. That's great. I love that. Uh, I love that fern that you have yeah. in the background. Hmm. It's a it's a, it's a beautiful a beautiful tree. Move like over here. Move the table. There we go. Perfect, perfect, perfect. <laughs> I love it. Move the table over. Move the table over. I guess it doesn't fucking matter. I'll just go right here. Nothing matters. Because we're in Los Angeles. We're in um, the West Coast, so it's still a little out of light out. Yeah, you guys are super lucky. Yeah, I am. I'm in the doldrums of New Jersey right now, so it's uh, nine o'clock and dark and boring and you know, yeah, fun. <laughs> How are you guys doing over there? We're good. We're good. Everybody's in quarantine. I heard the malls open today. Did you hear that? Did they really? That's what I heard. Really? Oh, sure, yeah. I don't trust you... it. I'm not going out or I don't know. I don't want to risk anything yet. I'm still we're in LA's in like phase one of three. Same of here. Same same with Jersey. Yeah, Jersey is I think so are you guys in LA? Yeah. So I'm pretty sure so LA if I'm putting this if I'm correct I believe LA and all of New Jersey and some of New York are pretty much like the worst of the worst in the world right now still cool. New, Jersey, <laughs> New, Jersey is, yeah, New Jersey is terrible I mean it's 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 been bad we've had uh, I don't want to get too dark on this but um yeah we've had like almost 12,000 deaths in New Jersey Wow. Which, you know, we, it's weird because New Jersey is that, that intersection of uh, the tri-state area, you know, we're coming from Philly to New York, Boston, 
DC and every we're just we're tied we're tied up, you know. So yeah, it's, it's not, everybody. Yeah. Everybody it's pretty, through it. Yeah, New York's it's uh, pretty wild. New York was home for a while for us too. Yeah, are you guys? Um, you guys are 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 Boston Bostonites, right? Is that's not Bostonians? Bostonians, Bostonians, Bostonians. That, East Coasters. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, well, that you know, a little backstory um, on our connection here, Maddie my partner one of my partners um a vital hand um really good friends with you guys and and has and has worked with you lynn for many years um touring with you guys actually today i found out that you played guitar for lost for words oh yeah that was for a while. my first tour ever really was that was your first tour ever ever yeah i was um i was 18 it was like my first year out of high school and they were like, do you want to come on like a two week burn with us? And I was like, yeah. And I just <laughs> went into a van with a bunch of like 30 year old men. Yeah. <laughs> or, no, they weren't like 30 yeah. at the time. They were like late 20s. So. You're just straight up giving Maddie's age away. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Maddie's like 49 I mean, now. Um, but it was like, yeah, my, I owe a lot to my parents. They just trusted it. They were like, yeah, go for it. There was no concern about being the only only chick. But um, they're, they're like big brothers, too. They took great care of me. And then, That's awesome. Yeah, yeah. Maddie's the best. I mean, in the back. <laughs> he's, Matt, Maddie's crazy, but he's, he's the best. <laughs> he's I, I, love, I love him to death. He's a He's a loony. He's an <laughs> crazy, crazy, crazy. Yeah, no, I was, I was, I was super young too when I started touring. My band, we, we kicked off. I was the youngest in the band, or I'm the youngest in the band. So we kicked off when I was like nineteen, twenty, and my uh, my parents were cool, man. We started the band in my in my parents' basement, and they were all about it. They were like yeah cool just learn how to do something else please so <laughs> i learned how to cut hair and you know that was that was that so i have you know it's nice i have two two little pieces of art i could i could uh you know hopefully pay bills with so it's nice but wait so show me real quick what did um what what did wall uh send you guys out these bad boys. we got the magic clip Oh, nice. Okay, I I got the magic. I got the magic clip, and and the deal. Right, perfect. We're working. Um, we're working with the same. You uh, actually, you've got the nicer one. I've got the corded detailer. Thanks, Wall. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, and the magic clip. These are these are honestly two of the they're two of the best clippers. Um, we got hooked up. Yes. You got you got the hookup for sure. Um, so only, tell me a little uh, bit about what you want. Oh, nice! You got the you got the one and a half, half and, one and a half. the one and a half and the half half. Yeah. yeah. So th those fun fact, those clips only come in the per in the professional um, oh. clipper clippers. So He's a professional yeah, clipper. yeah. It, it's a fun fact for somebody who you know maybe cares about it, but not many people do. So. <laughs> So yeah, tell me a little bit about tell me a little bit about what you have going on and what you're yeah, trying to achieve. Do you want to take uh, it? Do you want to take it? Do it? We do need to take it yeah. too, but um, you so touch I was in the right? undercut for a while. Yeah, um, grew up. There was this one point, um, which Out of Hands did a Las Vegas event, the last yep. Las Vegas, and I think they used the manic panic this. Shout out to Manny Penny, but they, they dyed my hair half blonde, but they finally came Oh, out. rad. We, we dyed, okay, cool. We dyed your hair then, yeah. rad. Um, awesome. That was a wild, that was a wild. That was, I don't thing. remember. I'm, Sorry. I'm trying to position trying this to better position on you. Better. <laughs> oh my God, I ruined everything. Actually, maybe, yeah, maybe. Maybe shift the bodies now. I think that's the purpose. Yeah. Is it shift the bodies, yeah. Yeah. Um, Perfect. Yeah, there so how, how the... Oh, <laughs> shit, it works. There we 
Um, it was so it was half long for a while. I was getting undercut. Um, I would hand hook them up with like you know you usually get high fade. Um, right. And then COVID happened, and this grew, and it grew fast. Like my side, <laughs> an inch. It grew fast. I think my hair goes faster than like a lot of most than the average person. It's, it's super. So yeah. So check. So my hair. So I I haven't cut my hair um, in solidarity for my clients and and whatnot, and to show show people. So. Um, yeah, I haven't cut mine in like two months and same thing. Like I, my hair is usually way like super short. It's like probably like this. Um, so yeah, I'm, I'm right there with you, man. It's, um, it's a, it's a, it's a tough, it's a tough road right now, but I'm going to get, I'm going to hook you up. I'm going to, I'm going to help you. I'm going to help Lynn through this, um, this wild process that we're going to, we're going to, this adventure that we're going, going to embark in. So throw your hair back to the position it was in. You actually had it. I had it tied up. You had it tied up perfect. I was actually going to say. Tied up. <laughs> I was going to recommend throw it in the clip, but you, you had it tied up. So perfect. I had it tied up just because, um, like I wouldn't mind a clip, but we don't have scissors or anything. So yeah. I, I think like a high right. hard part, I think it would look cool. You could walk it so, through that. so there's a few, a few tricks on what to do and what not to do when you're doing home cuts and when you're when you're trying to achieve something on yourself that is just not going to make you feel crazy, right? So at the end of the day one thing to expect don't ever expect um this is I'm, I'm speaking for everybody right don't ever expect to get the haircut that you would if you walked out of a barber shop or a salon from your favorite barber or, or stylist right because now at, 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 good. <laughs> <laughs> at this point what we're trying to do we're just trying to get by right we're trying to get by we're trying to achieve some sort of an assemblance of, you know, unruliness and clean it up a bit, right? We're not we're, we're not going to we're not going to try to achieve you know a, a bald skin fade. That is going to be pretty difficult. If I mean, if Lynn wants to go there, we could go there. But, <laughs> um, Look at her but, face. Yeah. <laughs> She's like, yeah, maybe. Fuck off. Yeah. <laughs> But so my so my opinion would be, we would start with a three, and we'd work our way down to a two, okay. and then we would we and then we would literally we would line every we would line everything up and we would square the back off, and that's it. And that will get you through until hopefully, knock on wood, you could you know get out of the house and get to a barbershop and have some sort of some sort of um normal life again if that's possible who knows or i but. just apply the skills that i learned today and i can do it again <laughs> i try to do exactly it. or when's your new barber we could we could also do that so sure. i yeah. so i i like have had my sides done for a while and quarantine i was like maybe i'll just grow them out so I kind I do them with like a beard trimmer. I can do like a a pretty like bad DIY fade, but it's not that bad. Let but me let let me see. Well, you know what? When we're when we're done with this, I'm gonna show you how to do your own hair. When we're done with this hair, I'm gonna show you real quick how to do your own hair. I've got I've got this method. It's called like the fla the flavor flavor method. I've created a giant basically like circle circular mirror and I put it on like a burlap strap and basically all you do is you take the mirror you have you have it on your neck and you take the mirror and it just sits just like that and you have a mirror in oh. front of you boom 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 and that's how you do like a straight up DIY haircut that's how I learned how to cut hair and my wow. own hair on a road I just did I just like trial and error just messing up my hair doing mohawks doing whatever and just 
doing some wild stuff. So I'll show you. I'll show you that when we're when we're done with this. But let's. Cool. Yeah. Let's... I don't know if I'm gonna do it because I think I'm actually gonna grow it out for a bit. But I would love to see technique. Right. Yeah. Yeah. I'll show. I'll show you the technique. We're, we don't have to do it. But I'll show. I'll show you the technique so you know. Um, but yeah, let's uh, let's start longer, and then work our way down, and then if we feel comfortable, we'll take more off. All right. All right. Awesome. So let's take the let's take the the magic clip. I saw a couple comments about Sean shaving his mustache, and I highly Wait, disagree with everybody. Oh my god! I'm gonna call. That's a, that's a beautiful door. mustache. Thank you. It took me. This is. I honestly started. It took joke. you so quick. It, it took me like. Did not take you very long. Two three weeks. But I love that. Like, this is fun. This might be funny. And it's just. Are you, are you putting anything in it? Do you have any wax? Um, I just got wax. Nice. Um, I was supposed to get some of uh, the Ruzel wax from Maddie, but he ran out. Right. Yeah, the Ruzel stuff's great. I'll 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 send you out some stuff. Awesome. Or so, like, Maddie, yeah. Maddie should have Maddie's out there. Yeah, she should have it. Maddie should have a bunch of a bunch of stuffs out out there. Um, sweet. All right, so let's start with our three guard. So they only sent us two guards. They only sent two guards. Box. Let me look in the box real quick again. But those only two guards I saw. I'm trying to get this. So I have. Oh, I, uh, shit. <laughs> I have this app that like locks me out of all my. I have an app that like locks me out of all of my apps, so that way I can mm -hmm. just like focus and not get distracted. And um, oh, I, know. I accidentally yeah. locked mine for like. I'll I'll do it where there's like a window where I can go look for like 10, 15 minutes and then just turn it back off. And um. I forgot that I locked mine for like 24 hours last night because I was like, oh. I'm gonna. Go, I have I have a lot of shit to do today, so I'm gonna like go in on it, and um, so I have to go on my iPad, but the iPad <laughs> needs to be charged, so there's like I can't position the iPad properly to be. Um, <laughs> so I'm trying to nice. maneuver this properly. Hold on. <laughs> Oh, I just no. saw Lisa. Yeah, sorry, so Lisa! Let's see. If we position this between the app. So you're currently in a fruit bowl. Yes. Um, Actually, you are. You're in a wicker. A wicker. Uh, I, don't, I don't even know if it's a, a bowl. It's like a wicker uh, plate. Wait, can you hear the plate? Wicker, wicker plate. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, is that, can that spill by any chance? No. Okay. No one can see <laughs> There's a laptop and then a water bottle propping it up. Nice. There we go. That's perfect. That's perfect. perfect. All right. So let's go back to what we're dealing with here. They only sent you two clips, right? No. So I, it was actually, I found it. So, so that, you said right to go to a three? Yeah. A th yeah, yeah, yeah. Three. Okay, yeah. cool. You scared like me. That. I was like, "Oh, we're gonna go. We're gonna go tight." Well, let let me ask you this: How tight do you usually go? Do you usually? I usually go skin. Do you usually go skin. Do you do a fade or do you do yes. one length? I do. Uh, I usually do a high fade. High fade. So it's a it's a fade, fade, fade. fade. Okay. Like what it. about? Well, we could do, we could do two things. We could, if you wanted to go, if you wanted to feel that you went super tight, we could do one length all the way around, which basically where your parietal ridges all the way around, we could take a one and just go straight up to that and go all the way around. It'll be one length, but it'll be nice and tight. Um. I was thinking just try something new since it's a new process, another thing for all of us. So, all right, cool. You know, Talk so you, I know I've seen photos of there's like still some hair up here. Yeah. You know what I mean? You want to you want to you want to keep that? 
Yeah, I, I, yeah, I'm with it. Right, cool. We're oh, gonna we're turn moving it. Again. We're moving again. Guys, nice. we're sorry. There's Maybe literally. Right okay. <laughs> awesome. All right. Let's go. So like, even if it's like a medium fade to like here, and then. Right, kind of. Right, right, right. But remember, just remember what we're achieving here. We're not achieving. Yeah. It's not going to be what. What you what, what you yeah what you're used to, okay cool. So, Lena, a, a little bit of um, I'm not gonna bore you, but just so you know, when I say the parietal ridge, this is the this is the ridge here. See, I'm getting I'm getting text messages too. Okay, cool. Right here, this is that parietal ridge. This is that stuff that you wanna you wanna maintain that length right in here, right? So if you okay. see, so what we're going to do is we're going to take that three and we're going to open the lever. You see the lever on the magic clip? Yeah. This lever? So we're gonna, exactly. We're going to keep it in that position all the way open, just like that. Okay. So not this. So that, this. That. Yep. Perfect. Perfect. Right. Awesome. So now what we're going to do, we're not going to, we're not going to start here we're not going to start by cutting here we're actually going to start by almost cutting in the middle here right right where he about is above his temple right here right so you're going to come in here and you're going to come out in a c formation boom oh. <laughs> sorry i should have warned you um like <laughs> bam stop so, yeah. you're gonna get fucked up here <laughs> <laughs> so like, bam. Exactly. Ex okay, so exactly. They, should it, should we brush it really quick? So I think it's stuck. Another 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 tip. You always want to have you always want to hold a comb. Always want to hold oh. a comb, right? So when when you're coming in with the clipper, you want to hold it down and then you're going to come in just like just like that C formation I showed you, boom, all the way around the head. So you're basically gonna, you're basically gonna hold, you're gonna take the comb, yep. just like that, just like that, and then you're, and then the, the oh, exactly, you're, you're, you're almost following the comb with uh, the clipper. What's it like through the middle? Oh my yeah. god! Let me show you on your head real quick. <laughs> no. So it, it's, just, it's just to keep tension, just yeah. to keep tension. So let's do it. So remember, it, it's it's a it's a three. And it, we're basically at a four guard right now. So let's fucking turn it on and go. You're not gonna do anything crazy. You're not gonna you're not gonna gouge his head or anything. Okay. Let's oh, not. Let's, <laughs> <laughs> let's uh, do it. Let's do this. All right. Let's do it. So start here first. Yeah. And then mm -hmm. go down there. Yeah. Right. So we're just yeah, we're basically think of it as in panels, right? That's the easiest way to do it. So you're basically gonna do five panels. Here, your temple mm -hmm. to the back of your ear right here, right? Then what's called your nape, which is the back of his head, basically, right? Yeah. And then this from where the nape and that side meet right there. You're going to follow it on that side as well. And then from your temple to the back of the ear there. So five, five panels. That's the best way to not lose, lose yourself in the haircut. You know how sometimes if you cut your hair, you're going to cut one one piece here, one piece there, and you're just fucking going all over the place. This is this is how you kind of control it. You just you just yeah. kind of go up and down. Boom, you're done here. You move on. You're done here. You move on, and you just you just keep moving from this side of his head all the way around, and you're gonna end up on that side of the head. Okay. Let's fucking do it. <laughs> Start here? Yes. Yeah. Start from here. Let's rock. Alright, get ready. Just the middle. Just the middle? Yeah. Oh, snap. There you go. Oh, damn. There you go. She's blending it. She's got the blend. 
Let me know if I slice your ear at all. You want to hold it up? Oh, that would be great. Fun fact for everybody, Sean has the softest earlobes <laughs> on the planet. <laughs> so soft lobe, Sean? Yes, it's crazy. He won't <laughs> pierce them. Yeah, she won't so pierce soft. them. Nice. Now I go back. Yep, we go going back. Can I? Can I go down here? Yeah. Well, there? so so we don't want to worry about that because we're gonna use we're gonna use a smaller guard for that. So we're okay. when we use this when you, we use a smaller guard, we're gonna be able to blend right in to what you just cut. Okay. Okay. Yeah. You see? See what I'm saying? Yeah, I didn't know if it was like a slowly lessen the the guard or right. So it... so exactly. So if you're cutting basically in like the in the middle with the guard that you have on now, when we put on that smaller guard, you're gonna cut down here, and then that's how it's gonna blend between okay. the smaller guard and the guard that we have now. Okay, I think I get this. This is, I'm sure this is something like once you are in the groove and you've done it, it's probably so easy and therapeutic and calming. Oh my God. It's, it's honestly, it's by far the most like meditative thing. One of my, one of the most more meditative things. Yeah. I, like I, I do in my life. I used to love mowing the lawn when I was a kid and like anything that has like a before and after. I love sweeping, I love vacuuming. Yeah, I'll so, tell you all. <laughs> I love vacuuming. I'm a little meat freak. But, exactly. I mean, music. That's it. You know, songwriters, okay. you know, you basically, you know, what, like, what's that? As, you know, as like as songwriters, it's the same. It's the same idea, right? You're starting with nothing. You, you're creating something. And hopefully the, the finished product isn't shit. You know, that's that's usually the go the goal. Sometimes even even uh, songwriting though you can like I know I definitely get in my head about it sometimes I need something to just completely tune out and this mm -hmm. like driving's another really meditative thing for me it's just yep driving and driving Sean knows <laughs> anytime he needs to go anywhere or I don't know if he needs to go get coffee or something I'm like oh okay. <laughs> yeah, that's a good that's, all right, that's a good point though with, with songwriting though like songwriting a good thing to like get out of like that headspace sometimes on that like a creative like rut is almost you get you get out of your own head and at least for me sometimes like yeah like driving and then listening to music and then just like straight up stealing the like getting inspiration and stealing vibes from other musicians yeah. it's like my all-time favorite thing you know dude yeah i when we used to tour in a band or like anytime we have to tour in a band if it's like festivals or something or whatever the situation is if if i'm driving and i have i get to pick music like i get so many ideas just from i'll, I'll go to like new playlists like discover playlists and just kind of put stuff on shuffle and just yeah. like Hearing the first five, ten seconds of something, I'll be like, oh, I wanted yeah. to do that. But sometimes the song won't even go where I thought it was going to go. So then mm -hmm. I'm like, well, I could do it. And like, there's a, uh, I don't know, driving just makes you want to write. It makes you reflective. Dude, it, and... So I had a, I had the same experience driving um, a couple weeks ago. Um, I straight yeah. up stole um, stole the vibe and uh, took like the rhythmical and, like drum beat e everything from this song. It's actually it's a cup. It was it was on Super Troopers two. It was e the Eagles death metal. The Eagles death metal covered fucking blinded by the light. I don't know if you've ever heard this cover. It is the fucking greatest song ever. And I and I say every every song is the greatest song ever. It's my favorite song like in the last like couple of weeks. 
I'm fucking obsessed with it. It's incredible. Like Josh Holmes like does this insane like drum beat for like five minutes that just doesn't change. And just like the loose it's just such a rock and roll song. They made yeah. it they made it so cool. Cause you know, it's a it's originally a Bruce Springsteen song and then what was it, that Manford and whatever what I don't even know who the hell made it like really famous. Um, but that band that made it really, really famous in the 70s, that was the jam, you know, Blinded by the Light. Um, but this tune, they took it to they took it to another level. If anybody anybody wants a new song, a new tune, whatever, fucking download this song right now. Blinded by the Light, yeah. Eagles Death Metal. It's fucking awesome. Oh, this is looking. This is looking good, by the way. Oh, sorry, sorry. Oh, sorry. No, yeah, those brushes. Those brushes are supposed to hurt. Are they? You know, you know, those brushes are those brushes. Those brushes are like when you get tattooed, and the fucking yeah. tattoo artist brings on like the dry, the dry paper oh, towel. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's what that shit is. The dry paper towel. Oh, yeah. the worst. The fucking worst. What's been your most painful tattoo? My mo you know what? Um, I've got two. One is a very obvious one, which was my ribs up in this area. Uh, which it was like a it was a case, and then. And then one was a few years ago. I have a fucking I have a tattoo right here, which is like the most least least painful tattoo part ever. I have the same thing here, um, but this was ten years ten years earlier. I guess for some reason when I got tattooed over here, I don't know what it was. Like I wasn't mad at the world anymore. I was happy. I just had like my first kid. Things were okay for the first time in my life. <laughs> I think I just didn't have this like anger. And with well, that's, that, that's a good thing. We, 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 yeah, which is a great thing. But I feel like I took, I used to take um, a lot of like this like internal like anguish out on my yeah. tattoos. By the way, you fucking know how to really cut hair, by the way. Um, this is incredible. <laughs> You, you, you're, you're, you have the vibe. You know exactly what you're doing right now. <laughs> this is incredible. See, nice. tasks, these, I am obsessed with. So before I, before I, like when I was still in high school, I used to mm -hmm. work at Hot Topic. And uh, <laughs> that all my days. So just Weird. Um, I worked at one in the mall, and I was, I didn't like talking to customers, but I really liked, uh, folding. Really? Because it was just kind of the same thing. It was just, like, the before and after satisfaction of it. Um, right, right, right. Yeah. I got you. Fold you know, out. I was, you know, I, I had one job at the mall. Um, I worked at Journeys, and... I'll tell, I'll tell you what, I, I thought I was going to lose my mind. I, there's something, there's something up with fucking the lighting at the mall. It, oh, makes, you, yes. it makes you feel crazy. I felt like a fucking crazy like person. With no, anything that's like, if you're stuck in a room with no windows and it's just yeah. artificial light, that shit gets to Oh that's my like, god! I go, I go, like on tour. It's like that if you can't leave the venue or there's no windows yep. in the green room, you can. It like it fucks with you after a while. I feel oh my that. god! I mean, I feel like we, we, lighting too is like really crazy. Hundred percent. We we tour a lot in Europe, and European venues are like you know European venues are like they're like old like war bunkers. No matter how big they are, like. The bigger they are, they become like airplane hangers, and it just, yeah. you know, European venues are just super weird, right? And 
um, and they're like, I, I found like with with the the time difference and staying up super late and then sound check and then and if you're touring in the middle of the winter seriously you'll get like two or three hours of sunlight and then yeah and then you're fucked you're just sitting in this dungeon in the middle of austria or dusseldorf yeah. or whatever it is and it's fucking crazy and it doesn't but... what's that Oh no! So yeah, I'm 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 thinking we we take the yeah. Let's take let's take that two guard. Buddy, two guard. Hey, buddy. Yeah. Let's, let's get that. Let's get that two guard together. Open. Yeah, the two should it be this or all the way? Yeah, you you know the deal. All the way open. Open. All. Yep. Perfect. All perfect, right. Perfect. Perfect. Cool. So, all right. Turn. Let turn his head to me real quick. Cool. Cool. All right. Awesome. So Side. now, now <laughs> basically, it's almost like it's almost like a you're going down a notch, right? So where you started before, you're going to go, go down a little bit and you're gonna create, exactly, you're gonna create the same, the same motion. And now you're gonna just take that bulk out below where, where you started ah. before. And that's it. And you'll see in the back, the fun thing about this is that when you use that C formation, right? On, on yep. what's called the nape area, it naturally it's called what's called in the nape the occipital bone is that bone that pops out right so that's yeah. naturally going to just follow this guard yeah, so what you're going to do is you're going to come right out right on that occipital bone and that's how you All create right. that's how you create that nice that nice little fade in the back there okay so let's let me do it. Um, let me sweep up his hair really quick because I almost <laughs> You'd make a good barber. That's that's a good uh that's a very good quarantine barber. You gotta you gotta you gotta stand on, on top of uh sanitation control. <laughs> Safety yeah. first. Damn, that's my yeah, idea. Things are things are getting a little crazy for barbers now. Their barbers have to wear like face shields and all sorts of crazy stuff now. Oh, oh yeah. It's yeah, so it's pretty you, wild. Again, like in real life. Alright, I'm going for it. You go for it? Uh yeah. I don't know. I have no idea. Still 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 have no idea. As of right now in my life, I'm hanging out with my computer and guitars and <laughs> and just writing songs, which is fun, but recording stuff and you know doing this, hanging out with my kids. So I'm not I'm not like terribly, you know, depressed about this this situation right now. But you know, I wish I wish we could uh, I wish we could have a little bit more. Um, freedom but you know optimistic and you guys you know you got to be safe everybody everybody has to be smart I think if everybody's smart about what's going on we could get ahead of this bullshit yes that's you, right. where's um lynn what uh what was next for you guys tour wise yeah we were supposed to be on tour right um we were, we were supposed to do a headline run Mm -hmm. Our album was supposed to be out, um, and then after this, we were supposed to go out with Halsey. Oh, and Jesus! A little bit has been postponed until further notice. We're like, 
it, it's tricky. I think everybody right now obviously had to postpone, and then people who were planning to tour and like hadn't announced anything yet also had to postpone. So there's a lot of like it's pretty saturated as far right. as like, booking tours. Every so it's it's definitely tricky. Yeah, everybody, everybody's in the same boat, you know, it's, um, it's a bummer because there was a lot of good, there's a lot of good tours this year and a lot of cool festivals, a lot of cool lineups, but I'm yeah. interested, you know, I'm interested to see next, you know, next year and, and how they go about festivals and just bigger yeah. shows, you know, you know, like 10,000 plus, you know, I don't really know how how they're going to go about that because it's not like this thing's going away. Yeah. I, I, I feel like it's going to be something with, yeah, sorry. <laughs> you're getting, you're stoked. Um, yeah, as far as, I mean, our, uh, our manager and I every day were kind of just like, let's just, let's assume that, touring isn't happening for like and this isn't actually what's happening but like assume it's not happening for two years like what's the game plan how do we keep things like engaging and, engaging? and i think everybody's having that thought right now but right luckily the main thing we're here to do is make music and then exactly. everything else is kind of secondary so uh, on the <laughs> the darkest of bright sides, at least, like, there's time to be creating and kind of. Well, that's, yeah, that, that was something I said, what, like, in the beginning of this. I said, at the end of the day, if you're a creator, you should definitely be creating and use this time to create um, whatever it may be, you know, if it's music, if it's podcasting, if it's art. Uh, painting whatever the fuck it is you know um just create and and you know and fulfill something else creatively that maybe you haven't in the past and you always have have wanted to and yeah is there anything know, like that, that um this is something you know this is something i i never i never really saw myself like doing so I'm, unless you know me or like whatever being on stage, I'm more like introverted, I guess, just as a person. So like, I always had a hard time speaking on social media. I never really cared about it that much. Not for any other reason. I just didn't really think much of it. And now I think it's kind of cool. I think it's engaging in a positive way if you use it in a positive way. Um, so this time has like has definitely opened that door up for me and um yeah and you know just focusing a lot of a lot of uh a lot of my efforts with um other projects other music projects and um you know a lot of just interesting you know a lot a lot of interesting music creative outlets that uh normally maybe i i wouldn't have done because i wouldn't have had time to do you know yeah i think i think that's that's that makes me that makes me happy you are really fucking good at cutting hair um so yeah hire me <laughs> i'm not messing around so this side the shape is absolutely perfect. So this side, where you are right now, what I want you to do. Yeah. So do you see the top? If you if you look at him straight forward, right? You see that right there, right? So what we yes. want to do is we want to we want to flatten that, right? We want to we want to if his head shape his his head shape is going like this right now. It's bowing out, right? We want that nice and straight. So what we want to do, we don't want to come in. We want to just flatten that out, ju just like that side is. So we want to almost feather that out a little bit. This side. Yeah, that side, right. 
on top there. See that? I feel like it's longer on this side. So okay. yeah, right there. You keep you keep doing your thing, right? You know, and then and then we're gonna and then we're gonna go in. And I'm gonna I'm gonna show I'll, you keep doing doing your thing below below that that part and then the with the two yeah 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 so okay. actually you know what you know what let's take care of that right now let's put it let's put a five on put a, a right. five guard on because that would be the best so there's way. no five the four and a six okay that would, yeah that would work a six that would work or a six uh do a put a six on Cool. Six. And now, instead of open it, close it. Oh, oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. Clo close the bad boy. Yeah, perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Cool. So now attack, attack that part. So now that, that With part no is, yeah, just, just that. We're going to feather that, that part. Okay. Yeah, right there. You wanna? <laughs> Sorry. There you go. Other people just said, Sean, blink if you're in danger. <laughs> Hell yeah. Oh, wait, you said. Is that better? Yeah. Fuck yeah. It's still just maybe a little, a little bit more. A little bit more. My hair is pretty thick too. Yeah, I can see. That's good. That's, that's a good thing. Got it from my mama. Awesome. Perfect. Okay. Nice. Killer. Killer, killer, killer. Sweet. Yeah, it's a little, a little, a little wonky. A little, a little, a little, yeah, a little bit. But again, remember what we're trying to do. We're trying to just, we're trying to get through, right? That's 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 the goal. So let's do. We got ten minutes before Instagram will kick us off. Um, let's make sure we do an outline, and I'll show you how to do this. All right. So we're going to grab the detailers. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. The detailers. Awesome. Okay, cool. So it's all about reference points. How, how do you like your sideburns? Well, you usually do a skin fade, right? And yeah. Right. So reference uh, points. Or make it thin. Right. So... Reference points always, always, always when we're doing sideburns and when we're doing outlines. So a reference point for his sideburn would be the top. Top of the ear? Not the, not the top of the ear. If you see where I'm putting this, right? The it's kind almost, of very... re, Sorry, not the top. The bottom of the top, I guess, right? would be right here boom exactly okay. right there right there that's right. your reference point that's where you're, that's where you're going to put a nice straight line should it be there shouldn't be any uh nope nope uh, and that's that's where you okay. basically you you put a nice straight line and to make a sideburn so you're okay. shaving down this won't so you're, hurt. no it won't hurt you <laughs> okay, and then after that, I go all the way around. No, yeah, I'll show. I'll, I'll, <laughs> I'll show. I'll show you. It. Okay, so this we you turn it up, turn it on, and then right at that reference point, 
boom, just make the line. Okay. And then shave it down. Ready? Mm-hmm. Shave it down. So, boom. Yeah, but make the line first. So, you know. Mm-hmm. So, make sure it's straight. Yeah. All right. Okay. Ready? Okay, now let me see. That's not bad. Perfect. Yeah, perfect. And now, shave that off. Go down or yeah. up? Yeah. Yeah, just go, go down just for insurance purposes. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Perfect. Perfect. Awesome. And, yeah. and now this is what I like to call the half moon. Okay. You take this. You're going you're gonna to basically do the outline around the ear in two sections. You're gonna go, you're gonna take the T, this is a T blade, right? You have the same exact blade. So yep. basically half of the blade is gonna come yep. this way, boom, to get all that hair. And then once that's done, you're gonna pull the ear down. You're gonna mm-hmm. use the other other half. Okay. And then I pause for a second. Then the other half, just like that. Okay. So, so this way. Let's do the let's do the first half first. So right. Yep. Yeah. Hold it down. Hold it down. Oh my god! Sorry. Okay. I think You're I damn did. Damn good at this. Awesome. Let me see. You know, you can't see it up close. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! Did I get you? Yeah, I got the Fuck! Another one! You got you the got ear? It. You got the ear? She got the ear! <laughs> Okay. <laughs> All right, cool. Oh, wait, sorry. There's a couple little guys that are still, still hanging out. Okay. All right, sweet. Now, do a spin for me. I want you to turn yep. around. <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna show Lynn. All right, cool. I'm gonna show Lynn how to. <laughs> you can do a spin too. <laughs> All right, cool. So reference points. This is how we're gonna do a straight line in the back. Okay. You're gonna put. You're gonna put the T or the T blade right in the yep. middle, right? Boom. Right in the middle. <laughs> Not in the middle of his head. Sorry. <laughs> all the way, all the way down. Oh. Yeah, yeah, because we're <laughs> we're cleaning his neck up. Sorry, so we're okay. making we're making a straight line on the bottom of his neck, right? Okay. Make sure his head's straight. Make sure your head's straight, nice and straight, and then we're just cleaning up those little little, little hairs on the bottom there. He's cute, exactly. little baby. Yeah, and we're making we're making a straight line across. Okie doke. But by using your reference point, remember, right in the middle, boom. So, bam, 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 bam. yeah. By going up, we're not, higher. not, not, not high up at all. Don't okay. as low <laughs> as low as possible. Just, just the okay. little, the little straggler, straggly hairs. That's that's it. And then go across. Perfect. Yep. Now go this way. Yeah. This way. Okay. Yeah. And go. Yep. Look at you. Awesome. All right. Cool. So stop. Stop it right there. Now. Mm-hmm.
Shake his head or go back, go back to the other side. Yeah, it's still, it's still this side. Oh, this would be awesome. I could probably do the boys' hair on tour. Yeah. Hey, trust me. I'm not messing around. You are fucking awesome. All right, cool. So now we want to do the horizontal line real quick. Now what? This line, this line right here. Oh. Okay. Yeah, you just just the the little oh. straggler hairs right there. Oh. I hate Instagram is going to kick us off. Oh no! It's, well, you it's been an on. it's been an hour. All right, this is this is the deal. You guys finish with all of the little tricks that I showed you, and then send me a picture, and I'll post it. And yeah, we'll do that. <laughs> and if you need it, actually, and if you need any help, just call me right now, and I'll Facetime okay. you. <laughs> <laughs> or is there a way cuz oh do you have a time limit the time limit do you have to go Yeah somewhere? Instagram oh, okay. kicks you off after an hour it's crazy Oh can we go yeah. back on This happened to me recently It was terrible it was terrible But yeah actually does it, sorry does it like, Instagram sorry? everybody on, we could we could do this if you want I'll you could fa I'll FaceTime you right now we could finish it What do you want to do yeah, yeah let's face, we'll face on you. All right, cool. <laughs> awesome. All right, everybody, thanks. Kisses, yeah, love, thanks, everybody. Guys. Thanks, Instagram world. You're the best. Thank you, everybody. Awesome. We'll see you soon. Peace. Peace. Wait, I have an idea.